Hey guys, so today I'm doing this get ready with me. I never do intros with get ready, get ready with me's, but I started getting ready really early so that this video would actually be good. Um, I am getting ready for Shrin's birthday tonight. She's turning 22, so we are just going out and doing a big thing. So this is the hair and makeup I'll be wearing. Um, I might throw my bangs up into like a like one of these, I'm not really sure, but by the end of this video, you'll see because the outfit will be on. I'm also featuring these products, the Scandinavia Primer and Finishing Spray, which are epic, epic products, and you'll hear about them uh, in the voiceover. But everything that you need to know with these products will be also linked in the down bar. If you want to know how I get ready, just watch this video, and I will talk to you later. Bye! Starting with hair, I am just, I have a heat protectant in it, and I'm just curling my hair with a large barrel curling iron and I'm going back and forth. And I'm leaving a bit out at the ends to make it more wavy instead of curly. After I've done a section, I spray hairspray, I spray dry shampoo, and then a sea salt spray into my hands and I make it all PC and more beachy waves than nice curls. And then I'm doing the same thing on the top section that I did on the bottom section. It's really the hairspray, the dry shampoo, and the sea salt spray that's really gonna give you the look of the waves and kind of like PC messy waves instead of just like, you know, nice done curls. I wanted to have a bit more volume because this hairstyle had to last like a really really long time so I'm just teasing really messily not in any particular order uh, just the sides and then the back as well. So I'm using the Scandinavia Primer Spray, and this primer is a spray primer which doesn't have a silicone base and it gives you a semi-matte finish instead of your making your face look slippery. So you can create this kind of stickier base for your foundation to stick to all night, which is epic. This My makeup lasted all night. Um, it also helps prevent redness, which I need, and uneven skin tones and large pores, but it also allows your skin to breathe. So this primer is absolutely epic. I'm next taking the L'Oreal True Match Foundation in W4 and N4. I really screwed up my color, so I'm just kind of blending them like a chemist to make it my perfect skin tone. And I'm putting this on my face with a beauty blender. Then I'm taking, I think it's a Revlon Color Stay uh, concealer and putting that on any red spots a little bit under my eyes as well, blending that out. Then taking the Benefit High Beam and putting this every single place that I want to highlight my face. So cheekbones, under my eyes, nose, forehead, and uh, I also do under my contour as well. That highlight can take away some of the coverage. I'm just taking the uh, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and putting that around my eyes just to give me a little bit more coverage. And then taking the nude stick in golden and using that as my eyeshadow and then the nude stick in angel as my inner corner highlight. And I'm just blending that out with my finger. And then taking my all time favorite eyeshadow uh, toast by Bobbi Brown and putting that in my crease. This eye makeup look is really, really simple and I want to keep it that way. And then I'm taking a Rimmel eyeshadow and putting that as my highlight in my on my eyes and then I'm taking the Anastasia like highlighter brow highlighter thing and just kind of going around my eyebrows to make them stand out. Then I'm just taking a black liner and putting that on my tight line and I am then doing a liquid liner, small wing liner, like what I do all the time.
Then just a white eyeliner on my waterline and the Bobbi Brown bronzer and natural as my contour, soft and gentle as my highlight, and L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara as my mascara. Then I'm taking this no color lip liner. This is just so that the color that I'm gonna use doesn't bleed. I really love this idea, I think it's really great. And then I'm taking Vaseline and just putting that on my lips as a base and then I'm gonna blot that off. Then I'm taking Sin by MAC. This color is super, super drying. So if you just like put it on your lips, your lips look disgusting. So I found a way to make it work. So I'm just taking it on a lip brush and I just build the color. Kind of sucks because you have to take out the brush as well as the lipstick, but whatever. I'm now finishing with the finishing spray. Uh, this takes away any powdery look that you'd have on your face and makes your skin look like skin. Gives your makeup amazing staying power. I was up until like five in the morning and my makeup still looked flawless. Uh, and it really helps your concealer and foundation not crease. It's just an incredible, incredible product and my makeup would not have lasted all night without this. My outfit, my shirt is from Black Dope. My like white layer is just a slip from a dress that I have and then my shoes are Jeffrey Campbell. Just want to keep it simple and pretty grungy, but kind of hip, you know? All right, that is all. I'm sorry if you couldn't really see a lot of what I was doing, but I was kind of in a rush. Love you all. Thank you so much for watching this video. Talk to you soon.